This week's schedule, morning collect collection, afternoon delivery, evening practice. This week's motto, don't slack off, the heavens and the wife are watching. <laughs> Mayor. That's kind of funny, actually. Alright, anyways. Uh, hello, mates. Usher Stone 96 here. We're going to be moving on in this uh, Anju and Cafe love quest. Actually, I forgot to mention in the, la in the last part. You can actually do this as early as, you know, when you turn into a human. Yeah, I've done it before. It's not difficult. I mean, like, you can't complete everything in the Anju and Cafe love, uh, love side quest. But you can complete a good majority of it. Like, well, I'll show it to you. But anyways. So, we have to follow this guy. Well, we don't have to, but... Well, there's nothing else to do, so I'm just going to- I'm going to, so... Mm, mm. Suck my balls. <laughs> oh, I was trying to act like Cartman. I don't know what he says when he says, like, sick my balls. Never mind. Alright, anyways. What's he doing? Oh yeah, that's right. So, I- he already- he already received the, um... Ah, the letter that was in the post box. I cut that out because you guys didn't need to see it. It was just pointless and stupid. I don't know why you walked all the way around to West East, Clock East Clock Town and then come back to North Clock Town. You could have just walked. I don't know. That is just weird. And yeah. So he's delivering the damn letter as slow as he's you know going. He's a postman. Come on, you can run faster than this. I mean, have you seen Ocarina of Time when you were given the bunny hood? You were freaking zooming! Yeah, <sighs> whatever. Hit this box, you always get full of rubies. Rubies. Babies! Alright, anyways. That frog becomes important later on. Where is he? Okay, there he is. Okay. Now, what he'll do is he'll hit the bell and the kid will come out. Let's see, watch. I didn't really touch it, but whatever. Hey, Pikachu! Can I talk to you? Hey, you, Pikachu! I've never played that game before. Hopefully they'll come out on the 3DS. I actually wouldn't mind a lot of ports, and I think I've mentioned that before. Just don't make it $40! What are they doing? Oh, now they stop talking. I don't know why the postman knows where he is. Where am I? This isn't eerie at all, you know? Where the hell is he? Come on! There he is. Speak. Green hat, green clothes. Anju wrote about you in her letter. It seems you are looking for Kefe. Can you keep a secret? Anju trust you? I shall also trust you. I am your father. No! No, I am Kefe. The Kefe we're looking for is an adult. When I look at you, I just see a child. The fairy makes a good point. I was turned into this by a strange imp wearing a mask. But I'm not hiding because I look this way. Skulkin! When I was turned into this, I went to see the great fairy in the shrine near the north gate. But on my way, my precious mask, a, a wedding ceremony mask, was stolen from me by a piercing man with a grinning face. Sakon! Well, you're just careless. You're like my partner. You bitch! Before my wedding ceremony, I was quite happy. I was targeted because of what I had I had been turned in turned into. Yeah. Oh my! I pity you. I I couldn't tell she was being sincere or sarcastic. I know Anju is worried, but I can't go out yet. I made a promise to her that I would bring the ser wedding mask and greet her. This pendant. Give it to Anju. You accepted the pendant. The pendant of memories. I'm apparently a kid, and I can't understand grown-up business. Uh, why am I a mute? I've been a grown-up before. I don't know. So okay, we're going to have to get. We're going to deliver the pendant. A pendant, not pendant. Pendant. Pen. Fuck it. That's what it should be called. We have to deliver it to Anju, 
And there's the postman. No shit, Ultra Star. Anyways. Ugh. We'll give it to her now. Give it to her as quickly as possible. I don't know if she'll accept it at the end of the day. She probably will. But I don't know. So just do it immediately. Couldn't hurt. There you go. Here you go, you sexy redhead. It's from Kebe! <laughs> Thank you! Yeah, no problem. Let's see what she says. I have made- I have decided to wait for him. I have made my promise. I'm fine with this. Believe- I believe him. Or is it I believe in him? I didn't read the rest of it. Okay, now before I end this video off, there's actually something I want to show off. Watch this. See, a guy should be running over- WHOA! Holy shit, he just like zoomed out, you know? Alright, if you hit him with your sword, he's still just like, you know, like, I don't even know. Don't mimic it, you moron. It's like, I can't even explain it. It's, it's just like lags, the entire game lags, do you see that? It's weird. It doesn't happen with anyone else you lock on and hit it with. Alright, so he's going into the curiosity shop. This is Sakon. The guy who... If you can't put two and two together, I'll put it in for you. The guy who stole the wedding mask uh, that Kefe lost. 100. Don't be such a rupee pincher, you mister. 200. Eh? Well, why don't I just offer you even less? And you know, this is the bomb shops. How about if I tell them about you, all about you? Jesus. I know this is like a shady shop, but you, know, you don't usually screw up, screw up your customer like that. Alright, fine, I'll take it. Well, you're guilty too. Eh? Ah, don't be a fool. A seller of stolen goods is just a middleman who's trying to provide his customers with good product. I guess. Look, I know nothing. If it comes to me, I'll buy it. I'm a chartable organization that helps people in need, if I pronounced that right. I probably did. I, I understand. And the total is... It's 50 now! So there you go! What? You said 100! Oh, so you don't want me to take it off your hands? Wait, 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 wait! It, it's a deal! It's a deal! The security, your, this curiosity shop guy is taking advantage of me. I just want my fair share. Fuck you! You stole not once, but twice. Probably more than that. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, there he goes. He says, this, he says the same exact dialogue. It's just so odd that he, you know, like, freaking... That it just, like, lags every time you hit him with your sword. I mean, I know that's what you're supposed to when you're just trying to save the old bag, but... It's just weird, I don't know. I didn't mean to talk to him again, actually. Doing it again. It's odd! I can't... It's, uh, it's weird. Alright. <laughs> so strangely amusing. Strangely. I don't know why. It's really weird. Stop saying it's weird. How many times have I said that? Oh, man. What the hell? What the fuck? Uh, he he's supposed to leave. He's supposed to go through that gate. What? Glitch? What the fuck? I never seen this before. He's not moving. What the hell, dude? I've never seen this before. What? <laughs> what the hell? That's so odd. I've never seen that before in my life. He's stuck. I guarantee you, you play this game and do the exact same thing that I've been doing, and it'll probably just run right off and through the gate. I've never seen this before. I can't get over that. What the hell? Oh my god. No. No, is he gonna stay here until dawn? Yeah, right. That is absurd.
I, I, I can't even get over that, man. <laughs> Alright, I'm speeding up. It... I, I don't believe this. He's stuck. Total glitch. Total glitch. That is hilarious. I've never, ever seen that. I can't get over that. That is like the first major glitch I've ever gotten in my entire plays of this game. I'll, I'll think I'll end it here because this is getting repetitive. <laughs> I'll see you later, mates. Bye. Wow.